It's already smelling good. Yeah, well, it should. It better be. <laughs> he looks so cozy. So, I'll just leave him alone. Oh. Five minutes. <laughs> Ten minutes max. If we put him to work. I mean, I can't buy a break. <laughs> Whose fishing pole is that? Who picked it out? Who found it? Hey guys, I'm Root with so, and Sherry. We are at Mill Creek Campground. It's, it's not a state park. No, it's recreational government. Isn't that what that is? Like, I have no clue, and it doesn't even matter. Okay. We're in Mill Creek in Berlin. Ber Berlin. <laughs> wow. Berlin you got Center. Fancy. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right. Berlin Center. Berlin, Ohio. Okay. Yeah. I don't All know right. if it's center. Okay. Whatever. It may be, but okay. it, anyway, um, it's Thursday night, and um, meeting a couple friends up here: mm -hmm. Emily Ray, Tom and Basana. Um, Kayaking, Hopefully. cooking, fishing, yes, bourbon, fun, bike, hike, um, whatever. We may play some games. Um, wrap it up. You wrap it up. It was over with with fun, okay. and then you and you start talking about this hiking. Well, I need some hiking. Let's so. see what we get into. Okay, we are in the Hickory Loop. And this is site 14. This is a nice site. Very private. Um, and very spacious. And this is actually the first site Chuck has ever picked out. I'll Usually pick out I, pick I pick out sites. Out sites. Name yeah, one. Name one. Name one. I don't have to name any. You call me up and you say, hey, what do you think about this? And I say, yeah, let's do it. Yeah, but I'm saying like on about. your own, on your own without me having yeah. to do anything. You're bothering Listen, I was about to give you credit and now you're yelling you're at me. And me. No, so I wasn't. Okay, so you're yeah. ruining my little site tour here. Yeah. So the yeah. site 14, this is a great site and thank you for picking it out. I appreciate that. <laughs> It's like 11.30, um, Emily and Ray just left. I don't even think we said this, but um, Chuck left a couple of hours ago. He's gotta work tomorrow. Um, and I was able to work from the campsite tomorrow. So this is actually the first time I've stayed by myself in a camper. And thankfully, I have Emily and Ray here just in case I may need anything. Um, I think I'll be okay. But it is a little scary, I'm not gonna lie. Um, and I miss my hubby. <laughs> but he'll be here tomorrow. So, all right, good night. See you in the morning. All right, shower house tour. I know uh, Art and Julie with the places where we go appreciate these. <laughs> so here you go, guys. Um, if you don't follow them, I will link them up in the description. They are awesome people. But yeah, here is a shower house. It's pretty outdated. And of course, no locks. So that sucks. Especially because Chuck isn't here usually. We always come up to the shower house together and leave together, but he's not here. So I had to do this all by myself and there's nobody around. It's kind of scary, but all right, back to the campsite. All right, guys, it is Friday morning and I survived camping all by myself. Barely. <laughs> um, usually I sleep through the night. I probably woke up four or five times. Um, just because I didn't have my best friend next to me. So I, I definitely missed Chuck last night. Um, I was a little spooked out. Um, only made me feel better that Ray and Emily were here, but I still, 
was spooked out. So would I do it again? I don't know. Maybe it just depends on the situation. But here I am, Friday morning, working from the picnic table. I got the fire going. I got the coffee brewed. We have some friends coming in. Um, tonight after they get off work, Chuck should be here in a few hours. Hopefully Emily and Ray are gonna bring me some breakfast. <laughs> um, but yeah, looking forward to a nice Friday. So see you guys in a little bit. Hey, 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 you made it. How was that? Yeah, it was, what do you mean, how was that? I was work and everything. Work was work, Sherry. Yeah. Yeah. Some well, people we, gotta go into work. We uh, missed you. You did, huh? We did. I did. Yeah. They did. Yeah. <laughs> well, I brought your stuff. Thank you. You're complaining. All right. I Hopefully it doesn't rain. Too. Yeah. Exactly. You brought some more wood? All right. I brought all this for nothing because it's gonna rain. I know. And Hopefully not. It, yeah. All right. So, get to cooking. <laughs> All right, so Chuck's been here probably about... Five minutes, <laughs> 10 minutes max. And we put him to work. I mean, I can't buy a break. <laughs> I, I come you can home, buy a break. I gotta load the, yeah. I come All right, home, let's make this food. I come home, I gotta load the kayaks up by myself, get more firewood, go to the store, cause she needs more stuff. Mm -hmm. And then now these two sitting over there lounging, <laughs> Hey, they I gotta, made me. I gotta cook for them. You know what I mean? <laughs> but they made me breakfast this morning. So. They didn't make me breakfast. <laughs> so last week we were supposed to make this and we didn't. Uh, I'm sure everybody knows Isley's Chip Chop Ham. If you don't know, you better know about it. And this is the missing ingredient that a lot of people don't know. The barbecue sauce, which I don't think is really barbecue sauce, but it's good. Simple. Heat this up. Heat the meat up and enjoy. So it's a staple from your childhood. Yeah, it is. From a lot of people's childhood, childhood, childhood. childhoods. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah, it is. I'm gonna heat this up though, because that's good that way. We can dip it in there. Perfect. All right. So, sauce is ready. It's warm. It don't have to be hot, boiling or nothing crazy, but it's definitely warm. And you can either have a little bit in the meat when you cook. And then add some later as dipping sauce, but I'll, it gets the bread real soggy. So I'm just gonna heat the ham up and then use that as dipping sauce. Good stuff though. And hopefully this is enough for everyone. What? We only got three, four pounds of ham. <laughs> I think it's plenty. Yeah. <laughs> Those are jokes. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's already smelling good. Yeah, it should. It better be. It'd be nice to have an early dinner and then you don't have to worry about yeah. you know, the rest of the night. Yeah, we'll have an early dinner and then we'll be cooking again at midnight. <laughs> Thank you. 
Hey guys, here we are. Sherry's got one. She got the she got the big one. Been talking about this catch and cook. And here we go. Wow. What you got? What you got there, Sherry Bear? I need help. Yeah. You got the you got the bottom of the lake is what they call that. Okay, you gotta know the difference between the bottom of a lake and hits. She said, I got, I think I got one, I got one. Look at her, she's still fighting it, like she got one on there. Everybody around looking. Oh, look at the lady out there in the kayak, she got a fish. And he ain't got nothing, he over there recording her. She got the bottom of the lake, again. Ladies and gentlemen, here we are. Why he's over there cracking chokes? No. Over here fish. Okay, so then again, whose fishing pole is that? Who picked it out? Me. Who found it? Okay. So, we're so then who tied that line up? Uh -huh. Who put that bait on there and told you this is what was going to happen? Why aren't you I, I have been. I've got, I'm on bites. Anyway, no, no, no. Break, swing them over here. Them. Swing them over here. She wants to do this catch and cook, and she can't even touch this damn thing. <laughs> this little dink bluegill. Aww. This poor little guy, he's a baby. You want to kill? Uh, no, get rid of this baby? See? Put him back in. <laughs> yep, there we go. <laughs> On to the next. Nice catch, Sher Sher. All right. All right, so Chuck is over here casting his line on the bridge. Meanwhile, I'm over here just catching fish. So, <laughs> how you feel? I feel like if you would start baiting your own hook, Woo! it would be much easier for me to <laughs> do what I need to do. Is that right? I do. Okay, but I Because I can guarantee Chuck... if I don't bait that hook, ain't no more fish being caught. Why are you talking so loud, though? Is it or this is a little, little blue. Would you ask? Is it sun or blue? Yeah, I call them all blue, girl. But when What's you the catch difference? Little... What'd you say? <laughs> what? I'm nothing. I'm so tired. <laughs> <laughs> She's got no energy. I'm over here now. lounging. <laughs> no more fishing for me. Hmm? It said no more fishing for me. The rest of the day. <laughs> oh, you'll be back at it. That's yeah. it. Here you go. Catch and cook. Are you keeping it? No. This Why? is a baby cat. Oh. We're going to let him go to live another day. Okay. Good job. Catfish. Catfish. Oh, Woo! Baby cat. Another baby. What'd you catch it with? A worm. Uh. A little, little red worm. I'm supposed to be catching bluegill. Instead, I keep catching these baby catfish. So, this isn't my thing. This is Sherry's deal. And I think I hear her screaming next door. And it could be because there are sewer flies all over this damn shower. I mean, everywhere. And I hear her screaming. So I'm assuming she's not liking the flies while taking a shower. And neither am I. But you gotta do what you gotta do. Maybe it's time for a new camper with a shower. Oh, hey, lady. Okay, really? Yeah. No. So what was going on in there? Um, that lady? No. Oh. I thought I heard some noise in there. There was a spider. It was a spider? It was literally, you heard me screaming? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so tip, the spider, Literally, it was almost in my bag. Open up the shower curtain. If I didn't see it, it could have kept crawling on my bag. So shake out your clothes before you put them on, because it could be a spider in there. Oh, what the hell is a spider gonna do in Ohio? Nothing. That thing was that big. It wouldn't. Have I done almost anything. took video of it, but I was too scared it was gonna jump. You were screaming that much in there though, yes. that many times. Yes. And I had to leave the, the shower. What the hell are you looking at? Something. You? Why are you acting like somebody in the back seat? 
You look, what the hell are you looking at? Because I'm, I'm over it. Yeah. So um, you should have seen my experience. I took a little footage of my shower. Was it a spider? No. What Sewer was flies. What's that? Yeah. Flies. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we live 20 minutes away, so maybe next time we just go take a shower at home. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody's doing that. All right, All let's right, go. That's it. So the good thing about camping with Steeler fans or friends, mm -hmm. friends fans, I can always come fresh dressed. You know what I'm saying? That's how you do it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm sure they'll love that. All right, we brought the rotisserie with us. And when you bring the rotisserie, who needs to do catch and cook? You know what I'm saying? We caught those guys. We caught these dudes at Meyer. <laughs> now they about to get laced up. Yeah, we're gonna see what happens. I mean, you know, I've injected them with this. I love this stuff. I use this on my turkeys too. This Tony, uh, I call it Tony Creoles. Cause oh, I nice. can't say that like a lot of other things. But yeah, it's a little warm. So we're gonna inject them and I'm gonna use a uh, local butcher's seasoning to season them with you know just the skin but yeah should be good we're gonna have a nice feast tonight hopefully these turn out good uh barry thanks for the string appreciate it. it's come in handy multiple times now so this is the best part of cooking hooking up this rotisserie it takes a little bit of time to get them chickens where they need to be seasoned and everything inject it but then sitting here having a beverage with this old lady. What? Yeah. Why you cause me such problems? All she does is make fun of me and laugh at me. I wish she would have just played the video before this. Because he spilled my <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'll put it in as a blooper. Oh, please. <laughs> that was funny. But that chicken ain't no blooper. Yeah, I hope not either. Yeah, a lot of people counting on it. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> right? It's a piece of joint down the road, though. <laughs> yeah. Always got a second choice. Oh, God. So here's one of the sites here. Just to give you an idea, this is site 80. And it's non electric. So if you have a generator or you don't mind have, not having electricity, very nice site. You have your own little beach area, access to the water, put your kayaks right in here. Um, they have a lot of these sites here, but most of them are non-electric too. You get a nice lake view. Again, non-electric, but it's very nice back here. It was. Alright, we're headed back from our little bike right here. And I, I need a knee bike. To go check on rotisserie. Hopefully it's still on there or not so burn it. better be on there. That's a good thing about a rotisserie. Well, I can you can walk them. away for a while. <laughs> yeah. And then come back and hopefully hope it ain't burn up. Alright, let's go see. Yes, sir. They look real nice. Add a few more pieces of wood to the fire some cherry that our neighbor hooked us up with Glenn and Kim and Dottie thank you guys for the wood we appreciate it now we got a wood connection this is awesome looks good all right they took a little longer than we thought they so did. it's like three three hours I think um, to cook. yeah something like that but they smell phenomenal. I'll give them that. They look great. What they taste like, I don't know. But they smell great. All right, so this is our little potluck with our people here. You got some sausages, got the chicken, got corn, got some salad, got potatoes, and we have baked beans. Homemade baked beans. Homemade baked beans. Uh, I believe those are collard greens. Yeah, yeah, that's, those are collard greens. Fasana made the collard greens. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we are here with some good people. Ray and Emily, what's happening? <laughs> Emily's sister, hey, hey. We are about to feast.
they can see them. Bad news. We're on another night hike. Hopefully nobody gets injured. <laughs> Scarlet's leading the way. <laughs> hey, what a beautiful night. It is a beautiful night. Rain stopped. We weathered the storm and we're out. Here we are. Let's get after it. <laughs> she is. Come on, girl. <laughs> she said, mm. <laughs> Right there. Hey there. Hey. Hey there. Do you, you know where the bears are? Hey there. Mm -hmm. All right, so the end of the trip, we're at a totally new campground. Don't ask what's going on, but. We forgot to do our outro, and that's did. just what happens sometimes. So yeah. we're doing two in one, kind of. Uh, so if you watch this video, watch the next one, you can see us wearing the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Mill Creek, Berlin Center, Ohio. What an awesome campground. Yeah, I was wrong. It's not Berlin, Ohio. That's a whole different city in Ohio, so make sure you go to Berlin Center. Yeah, if you get a chance to get out there, um, I think Sherry was mentioning which loop? Oak Loop. Yeah, it's primitive, but the sites are amazing. Yeah, the they sites really are, are, that's the mm -hmm. best loop in that park. Yeah, if you got a boat, bring your boat. If you got kayaks, bring your kayaks. It's just a, a great all around lake and, it is. and a fun time there. Bathroom, not so much. Yeah. But it is what it is. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, Emily Ray, Sarah, Tom of Asana. Awesome hanging with you yeah, guys. Always uh, a great four time. by four play. If you guys don't follow them, yes. follow them on Instagram, YouTube, right? Yes. Facebook, <laughs> right? All of the above. Uh huh. <laughs> um, but great hanging with, out with those guys. Um, Get to meet their mom, too. Emily's mom. Emily's nice mom. to meet you. Yep. Um, and we had visitors come up, Tiffany and Ben. Yep. Thanks they for the peppers. Us, yeah. We and cooked they, those during the week. We did. And they were great. <laughs> they were. So if you do sauerkraut, uh, put yeah. you some peppers in your sauerkraut. It, it, it changed delicious. the whole flavor and it was it was very good. It really was. And she brought you your garlic peeler. And she brought my garlic peeler, which is uh, wow. it's an awesome color. You guys will see it one day. Yes, yeah, so he'll be using me. that soon. Mm -hmm. Very pretty color. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, good trip. Good trip. We're headed to where we are right now. Yep. <laughs> so we'll see you there. Till next time. Safe travels. Mm -hmm.